I think one very important problem that science has only understood in recent years and that most of the general public is not aware of yet is the problem of ocean acidification. Uh, the carbon dioxide that we put in the atmosphere is also entering the oceans. About 30% of what we have added to the atmosphere from fossil fuels has actually ended up in the upper ocean. That is uh, shown by measurements from research ships and we also know this because uh, not all the CO2 that we emitted is still in the atmosphere, uh, some of it is simply missing and that missing CO2 has been sucked up by the ocean at the ocean surface through gas exchange. Now that sounds like a good thing because otherwise the CO2 concentration in the atmosphere would be rising even faster but on the other hand it makes the ocean waters go more acidic because uh, that CO2 dissolved in ocean water forms carbonic acid. And this is a, going to be a major problem for marine life because there are many organisms in the ocean, ocean that form um, shells of calcium carbonate, just like the seashells you can find at the shore, uh, the coral reefs, and a lot of microscopic plankton organisms that form the bottom of the food chain in much of the ocean. And uh, these organisms cannot do that, they cannot form their calcium carbonate shells if the ocean water gets too acidic. And uh, in about 50 years we will reach that point in parts of the upper ocean and uh, then spreading and that will have uh, major detrimental impacts on the whole ocean ecosystems if we don't stop the rise in CO2 concentration in the atmosphere. So that alone would be sufficient reason to stop emitting so much carbon dioxide, even if carbon dioxide did not cause a global warming, which we all also know that it does.